Hi, I'm Niall Heaney from Gulfstream Boat Sales. Today we're taking a look around a Sea Line F38 Flybridge cruiser. This boat was built in 2014. It was first sold and commissioned, delivered to a new owner in uh, 2015, April 2015. It's currently got 320 hours on the clocks. It's an absolutely fabulous boat, in beautiful condition, presents almost like new. It's packed to the gunnels with optional extras. It's probably the best spec example out there. Um, it's uh, fitted with a Volvo Penta D6 330 horsepower steering drive engines. This boat is just under 38 foot long. It's 12 foot 4 inches wide. It's an extremely spacious cruiser, a really um, voluminous hull, but it doesn't really sacrifice uh, sea keeping ability or performance either. It's a really great going boat. This one's uh, good for 33 knots with those uh, 330 horsepower Volvo D6s. It's in absolutely beautiful condition. We've got nice, a uh, large hull side window for the uh, guest cabin there um, with a gloss black surround on it. Got a big, uh, chunky rub rail with a stainless steel insert. Nice high guard rails along the, uh, the deck line, all in beautiful condition. As I said, this is a big, spacious boat, lots of room in it. Um, nice, tall hull sides, um, quite a tall roof line as well. And you've got high guard rails around the flybridge. But because they have broken it up so nicely in the design, it doesn't look, it looks a lot sleeker than its dimensions would maybe suggest. So you have um, fully gloss black uh, pillars and window surrounds around all those uh, big open uh, saloon windows. Gives you a sort of floating roof line impression. Um, so that really breaks up the, the height of the, the roof line. The high guard rails around the flybridge make it really safe and secure sort of feeling place to be. We have this uh, fantastic seating arrangement across the transom, so it's these convertible uh, seats. So you can have the seat backs either facing uh, forward, so you can sit facing the cockpit, or rearward, where you can sit here uh, on the swim platform if you know if you're having a swim off the back of the boat or just relaxing for a nice drink. All the the decks are laid in real teak, I should say, as well throughout the boat. So side decks. Flybridge steps, cockpit floor, swim platform, all laid in real teak. The fore deck itself is nice and spacious. You've got uh, little uh, tow rails down along here. We've got a nice flat surface, which is all molded and on skid. And this boat also comes complete with a full set of sun pad cushions for out here. The engine access is really straightforward. You don't have to move anything out of the way. Um, you just lift up this uh, hatch in the floor. Huge big hatch. Lifts on two big chunky stainless steel struts and you get a nice little uh, walkway ladder down into the engine room here. Stepping into the saloon on the boat, it's a pretty conventional layout but it's uh, beautifully done, really well finished off, um, spacious, lots of room, lots of ways to, dip, to, to configure things so it's very versatile sort of layout. Um, we've basically got an L-shaped uh, sofa on the uh, starboard side. Um, around this big oversized table. We have a pull out bench here for another occasional seat, like a little twin seat there. You can slide that another way to give it a bit more room also. Um, we have storage compartment with a TV, DVD player uh, in it at the, the back corner, the rear corner. We've got another little bit of countertop space here. We have a nice twin wide helm seat and then a couple of steps down to a little lobby area with access into the the two cabins, the day heads, and also your uh, your galley down there. So the large central door in the lobby uh, gives us access into the uh, master cabin. We've got a full length vanity mirror on the back of the door, and then a nice little lobby sort of corridor entryway with a again another opaque uh, skylight to throw a bit of natural light down here in the walkway. So we've got a huge big island berth here, double bed. This is a master. This would be the master cabin, obviously. Uh, here's the access into the guest cabin. So you step down uh, in here. We've got a double berth that's configured as a double at the moment, but you can remove a filler cushion, slide a wee shelf in, and make that into, into two singles uh, as well. There's a beautiful commanding helm station on the boat. Um, again, continuing a theme here, but it's packed to the gunnels with equipment and options. So, um, first of all, a really comfortable helm seat. This boat obviously has loads of room in it, lots of internal space and accommodation, but it also has a, you know, it can really put a smile in your face whenever it comes to driver enjoyment as well. And by all accounts, the sea keeping is fantastic.
There's a beautiful spacious flybridge on the, on the boat. Um, lovely big wraparound U-shaped seating area here. As well as the wraparound camper covers downstairs that we spoke about. There is a full bimini top for the flybridge. Um, so a big flat roof section in the same light grey canvas. The flybridge helm is packed with almost as much gear as the lower helm. Um, so we have a tilt adjust steering wheel. Lovely steering wheel actually, like grey leather wrapped with these stainless steel spokes on it, looks beautiful. Um, it's tilt adjust. You're sitting bang in the centre of the boat, so really sort of fun place to drive the boat from. Again, if you're chucking it, you know, if you're having, if you're out on your own or out for a bit of a blast, you can you'd really chuck it about from up here. If you like the look of this Sea Line F380 flybridge and you want to find out more about it, then please sign up for VIP access on our website at gulfstreamboatsales.com. All you have to do is pop your name and email address into the box below this video on our site at gulfstreamboatsales.com and you can get VIP access which is completely free. Once you've logged in then sat, navigate back to the Sea Line F380 page and you can watch our full length video tour where we go through everything in much more detail. We take you through the dash controls, the switch gear, uh, we show you around all the individual cabins, you can have a look inside the storage compartments, you can get a really good look around the engine bay. You can also watch the full extent of the water test footage that we have with this boat as well and hopefully just get a much better idea of the condition that this boat's in the spec of the boat, what the boat's capable of, and it should give you a better idea of whether it might be of interest to you or not. Um, so that's sign up for VIP access at gulfstreamboatsales.com. If you want to be kept up to date with all our reviews as and when they go live, then the best way to do that is by subscribing to our YouTube channel. So just click subscribe on YouTube and you'll get a notification every time we post a new video online. So that's the, that's the fastest way to find out about new boats as they come to the market. So thanks very much for taking the time to watch this video. If you like it, sign up for VIP access at GulfstreamBoatSales.com.